Hello and welcome to this fifth episode of Escape the Pacific. We are here on the ocean, sailing away towards Island C. Um, last episode uh, we found the sextant and the watch. Here we go, sextant, watch. So, oh, today I think we're gonna try to set our watch so we have the correct time so we know when to use the sextant even though we don't have to use it quite right away uh, because we still have a few more islands here to check out that one is the one we're gonna go to next um, well yes so last episode uh, was a bit different and that was because the audio was absolutely terrible so I couldn't use it. Um, but I did the best I could uh, of that situation. Hopefully uh, it wasn't too boring. And here we are. a look. So a barrel. Always fun with barrels. You can keep things in them. Very nice. No, I just wanted to drink. Thank you. And let's see what we have here. Nothing. Sticks. Always good. And small crate. Let's take you back here. There we go. And no fruit, no. <coughs> I'll just leave you and campfire. No, no. Let's see. Have we triangulated you? No. Yes. No. So two more tiny islands to visit. Compass Island, yes. Okay. So we had one barrel, one empty chest and one crate. No. I've been playing a different game. Uh, okay. All right, so oil, cheese, bread, bandage, jar, carrot seeds, and a bit of other stuff. So I think we're gonna put these away right away. Let's see here. This one right? Yes. And we have bandages and and bread. Right. <coughs> Just put this away as well. Is this the bottom one? No, empty. Here we go. And no, here we go. So we have carrot seeds. So maybe we should try and build, where was it, this one, a plant box. And we'll do this one because we can attach this to our raft. But to plant things, 
we need soil. So we need to make that first. So 15 small sticks is what we need. Um, I think we're going to start with that because it takes some time for the soil to be ready. sharpen our axe. Oh yes we do. No wonder it takes forever. So do it like that and we'll just place our composter here. Five more. We'll just chop this one up. Oh no, you're not exhausted. It's only in your head. Very hungry. Okay. I'm gonna go eat. I'm exhausted, so I can't jump. <laughs> there we go, thank you. How does it look? We need vitamin C, so let's eat two of you. And still hungry, so let's eat you. And maybe you. Right, and let's drink some water. And we're fine, so let's get back to it. No, axe, not hammer, axe. And we also need fire sticks and I will show you why in just one second. Okay, so first Medium composer. Com com composter. Composter. So here we have a fire stick. And you see it says 0%. And you have three zeros next to it. And if we put one of those in there, uh, you get the number 10 in the middle. So we need. So maybe like 25% and then we need sand. So we'll take one of these. Sand. So 2377. Forty-eight fifty-two, and now we need this. Come here, stupid crab! Stop running. I think we need another one. So some organic. I think you can also use like dead grass or uh, green coconuts or something like that. Do we have any green coconuts? Yeah, we do. We have dead grass. If I 
Cactus. Anything else fun? Yeah. No. Tall grass roll. I don't know if it works. Let's put the dead grass in and see what it counts as. Yeah, same as the sticks. So let's put our meat inside here. Oh, we need so much more. Um, let's see if the coconut works. Chop this down. We chop this down. Hmm. Double palm fronds. Yes. And we got these. I'm just gonna move the palm fronds out of the way. Nice. Bug. You get twice as many palm fronds than you would have. Okay, let's see if this works. So, yes it does! So 29, what does it say? 38, 33. Um, so one more of those. One more s fire stick and more sand. Even more sand? No. Okay, so this one is now making soil. Uh, so we'll just leave it to do its thing. And let's go diving. See if we can find anything fun. So, off with things. We go, how's my stamina? It's okay. So what do we have here? Nothing there. And medium chest. Oh come on. Up up up. Hurry back before the light is gone. See if there's anything else here. Yes, there is. Here's a small crate. And nope, I think that's it. And put this back on. And what do we have? No. God damn it. So, thick candle, lantern holder, and torch holder. And here we have. Ooh! Old iron axe. Let's sharpen you. So away with you and hello. I need to try it. I'll try it on this over here. Oh, that's awesome. How many did it take with this? So two with the iron axe and Six with the primitive axe. Very good find. This will make things a lot easier. It's fun. Oh, one. One hit. That's awesome. And for small tricks. Oh, one hit. 
<clears throat> okay, so I'm tired and I'm freezing. And I should have brought these. Uh, so one. Here we go. So I think I'm very cold. I need to make a campfire. So I'll go and pick up the rocks from this one and move it. here to make our campfire right here. Oh, and fire sticks. And rocks. Come on. I'm still cold. And right. <clears throat> and let's end my body temperature is going up. So I'll just stand here, I guess. sleep next to the fire and sleep until sunrise. And let's sleep until we're fully rested. Thanks. And how's our food? A bit hungry, a bit thirsty, so let's drink and let's eat some fish. And maybe one of these. So let's go and have a look at our soil. Need an empty jar. How much do we have? Oh, quite a lot. It filled it up. Yes. So let's build our plant box. And we need three medium planks and sand. So let's see. We had planks, right? Somewhere? No. Is it over here? I know I had planks. Am I blind? Yes, I am. So we need one, two, three. So, and sand. And one more. There we go. And the hammer. <gasps> Ta da! Lovely plant box. So, we need a rope to attach it to our raft. Where do we want to put it? We want to put it so it can rain on it. So maybe right here. Here? Yeah. Touch. 
Thank you. Okay, so now it says it has zero water and zero soil. So if we take this one and soil, 100. Perfect. So we can take another one of these. And we need water and the seeds. So we'll our water and now seeds carrot seeds <gasps> minus zero percent okay so I guess we just leave it there see what happens Okay, since we're going to be here for a while, I think we can take the opportunity to make another fish trap and stock up on some fish. So we have one small stick and it gives me a chance to try out the new axe. So we can just oh, I love it lovely lovely axe I wonder if we can keep soil in a barrel that would be handy have to try. And there we go. And hammer. And we're finished. So let's just drop these. And put you um further out. Yeah, that's fine. So, let's make a sundial and see if we can set our watch. Simple sundial. One fire stick. And we have that. Okay. And it says a simple sundial. Okay. So I'm guessing when the shadow is at its shortest, it will be noon. And that would be right about now, actually. I'm thinking because of the angle, it will be when I cannot see it here. So let's equip our watch and are we standing right behind it? Almost. Yeah, I would say that this is noon. So R. Noon. Let's try the sextant. Where's the sun? There it is. And the sextant. And look. And move it down. This wobbling is kind of annoying, but That's the horizon, right? So, mark. Accurate measurement. Perfect. So, let's see. 
We'll zoom out the first cluster. I don't get it. Can we mark? No, not anymore. There we go. I don't know. I never gotten this to work properly. But I'm guessing it will once we're out on the open ocean. <coughs> and not within a cluster, perhaps. So, sundial. Check. Let's go see how far along this is. Uh, 2.9 meters. So we'll need you and the barrel. Let's see if we can keep soil in a barrel. It would be a good thing. Yes, we can. Lovely, so we can take it with us. All right. But there's some left to be produced, so let's get organized. What's in this one? The candle and light holders. So one of these we put in here. This one and this one we put up uh, right about here. Yeah. There we go. And then no, I want this one. Perfect. Okay, let's go see how far along our soil is. 67%. So what else can we do? That's fun. We'll just kill a crab or two. Can you? Thank you. Oh, here you are, waiting for me. Yes, and here's another crab. So much easier to kill crabs with this. Oh, I wasn't supposed to do that. But he oh, look at this. An army of suicidal crabs just waiting to be chopped up no by me here we go perfect and another one dead crab Another campfire. Fire saw. Why? Thank you. And let's put you here. Sometimes it takes a while for the game to register the light. I've noticed. Can I eat this? Yes, I can. I want to. No, I don't. I want to cook them. Ooh. Only crabs. Please. 
I also want to try something that one of my viewers, one of my many, many few, <laughs> many few, that's contradictory, one of the few viewers that I do have told me that you can make salt in seven seconds and we're gonna try that because that sounds amazing actually. There we go. Just enough. Oh, and it's already done. First one. And I'm hungry and I'm thirsty and I need this firewood. Bush. I wonder if there will be a use for bushes in the future. It seems like it would be good. I actually can't wait until story mode is available. I think that would be a lot of fun. Ooh. Almost burn. No, burn them. That one's done, and this one is soon done. I can actually drop this for now. This as well. Okay, so for this seven second thing, uh, we need the bucket and, oh, I'm sorry, let's try out, no, wait, <coughs> so we'll put a bucket here and let's try lighting this, <gasps> awesome. That's really good. We need another fire stick. So we need coconut fiber. Do I not have coconut fiber? Yes, I do. Good. Okay, uh, but I wanted to get one of these goblets, this one and something to get salt water from. So we'll drop this here. Pick this up. Put it over here. So we're prepared and I'm just going to extinguish. Okay. So one is supposed to put the bucket. No. Take the goblet. Take the goblet. Thank you. Take salt water, put it in the bucket, and place it on the fire. And voila! That's awesome. Thank you so much. I'll leave a link down below to the video where he shows this because this is very useful. Nice. J 
just need more buckets. I really wish you could make or craft buckets. I'm thinking it would be something, maybe, to put in the game. Because what happens if you lose your bucket? Then you will have no bucket. Zero bucket. Very tired, very thirsty. No, 76 tired. I think this David character is a bit whiny. And there we go. Cooked meat and salt. Perfect. And now I can see nothing. So let's light this up again. Yeah, I really think the candles give you better lighting uh, because this one, let's just try it. And I'm just gonna put away this and then I'll extinguish this. You see, that's hardly anything compared to that one. Pick you up and we can eat one of you. How nice! And let's make a fire stick. Actually, let's make two fire sticks while we can. Okay. I wish we had at least two more barrels, but for because I wanted to have one barrel with salt and one with oil just in case oh I don't need to good to know so let's sleep until it's about 10% I think is probably a good thing. So there we go. And let's sleep on the beach until sunrise. Hopefully we will be fully rested and it would... Yeah. Perfect. <clears throat> so let's see. How much longer do we need to wait for this? Let's have a look at our carrots. Oh, there's a tiny plant there. How lovely. I'm a farmer. Who knew? Oh, rain. Let's put out. Rainwater. Drop, 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 drop. Be quick about it. Nice tower. So here we go. And here comes the rain. So I think I'm going to show you a small trick I learned, which comes in very handy. When you are sailing between clusters and you need to keep your water supply fresh. For this you need two barrels and one bucket. 
well you can use other things as well but the bucket is more useful because it holds the most amount of water so you take your bucket just gonna and you can see here I have 78.9 liters of water and it's getting uh, bad because that little green bar is showing so I'll take 10 liters stand out in the rain for a few seconds and when I put it in the other barrel it's fresh again so you can do this every time it rains and freshen up your water now you see 100 liters of fresh water we actually have more than we need Oh, I'm freezing. Yes, I know I'm freezing. I wonder if my health is going down. No, it's at 100. So, I guess we're fine. And just collect the last of this. done. So I haven't seen anyone else use this um, water trick. Hopefully it will help you to stay alive when traveling between clusters because that's when you need it the most. So let's see how much soil we have. 48%. Not done yet. Oh, we need to go check our fish trap as well. Let's see if we caught any fish. Um, drop. Oh well. Let's go get our fish. Where is it? Oh! Over here. And it's full. Let's get that fish from the trap. Perfect. And let's put you on the drying rack. was that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. It should have been 10. Right? Did I leave some? No. Okay, so two fish mysteriously disappeared. Okay, well, nothing I can do about that see how much 46% I don't know if it's counting up or down I think down we'll wait for it nothing else to do in the meantime I think I want to make more of these plant boxes at least three more so let's go ahead and do that Hello, crab. What are you stuck on a shell? Yeah. Uh, crafting equipment. Plant box one, two, and three. Oh, there's my fish. See, it's stuck in my hand. Or maybe the loneliness and solitude is finally getting to me and I'm losing my mind. I've heard the psychological impact can be great. Yeah. 
Yep. Our little fishy, what should we call you? What is a good name for a fish? No. Um. Oh, we have enough. You look like a bird, yeah. <laughs> so here's my hammer and my fish bird. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so uh, me and Burja was thinking uh, that we wanted to try and plant potatoes. I mean, in real life, you don't need seeds. <laughs> um, so maybe, no, look, perfect. So two potatoes and I just want one more carrot seed. Two with carrots one with the potatoes. Perfect. So we need some some water. No, that's oil. This is water. No, this is water. Fine. So there we go. Fill it up again. Place it in here. No. Place it in there and let's go get some soil. And maybe I should report this <coughs> bug. Burya stuck in hand. Oh, we need more. See? Get it from this. Water and soil. I'll just put some more soil in, yeah. Now, I think I'm going to walk around with a stick in my hand so I can look at Burja. No, I'm not. I'm just kidding. Let's make another fire. Hello, Burja. Small fishy. You are my only friend. And how much is left of you? 26%. Okay, so we've just woken up. Hello, pretty crab. Let's go see. And it's ready. Finally. Perfect. We can now leave this place. And we need one of these. And I think we'll just put you over on this side. How about right here? Right, and the plants are growing. Awesome. So we'll just gather our things, which we have already done. Let's just see if there's any more fish in our fish trap before we leave. Almost full. So we're just going to cook the fish. And then we'll be done with this island. Now I have this.
Okay, <clears throat> so I think this is a good time to end this episode. We built some plant boxes and we made soil and we got an absolute gorgeous axe. See, gleaming in the sun. And also, oh, that's that's nice. Oh, yep. So next time we'll go over to that island over there. And I'm sure I named this, but maybe I didn't. Maybe it got lost in one of the crashes. I've actually had a few this episode. So, oh, I'm almost burning the fish. There we go. So, <coughs> so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, and if you liked it and you want to say more, you know what to do. And I hope to see you next time. Bye. <coughs>